Today's video is brought to you by Card Kingdom. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Single Scoop. This week, we're playing Mono Red Phoenix. I try to make a slight deviant of the modern version, but for historic, of course. Uh, and of course, in this format, we don't have cards like Manamorphos, which is a very powerful card that we're missing, and there's really no replacement for it. Um, but And we, instead of a Lava Dart, we don't really have much there either. So we're going to go with Spike Field Hazard. Otherwise, we're still playing what is mostly the Mono Red Shell. We have Kill and Fiend just as a way to quickly close out the game with uh, all the crash throughs and Infuriates and things like that. And then with all the cheap spells, you know we got to play everybody's favorite thing. Thing, Arc Light Phoenix. So yeah, we have cheap threats. Uh, we play only 19 lands, but that's because we don't really need more than three lands in our, our games because we just need to cast three one mana spells. Uh, and so yeah, Soul Scar Mage, Kill and Fiend, Faithless Suiting, Arc Light, and opponent's face. That's where we're going. Are you looking to get an early start on Modern Horizons 2? Well, CardKingdom.com has all those cards up for pre-order right now. We don't want that, so we're going to mulligan. I guess this is better than nothing. So we're going to go ahead and... Play. We have no spells, but we sure as heck are hoping we draw at least one. We only need a draw spell to start, quote-unquote, popping off. So, let's see how this goes. All seed... All right, get in there for some DiMaggio. I shouldn't have played a land because this means that they could, like, I mean, maybe they'll think I was short land, so they would block. And so now we play for what looks to be a little bit longer of a game here. Uh-huh. Let's see how this goes. So now we pass. We just need to make sure this next turn we actually follow it up with more spells. So we are going to try to pop off, if you would. And I quote, pop off. Oh, good. Indestructible. That doesn't matter. So, a draw spell. That kind of sucks, but whatever. Alright, hold on to some cards here. Any of our draw spells? Another Soul Scar Mage. Alright, that feels kind of bad. How unfortunate. Okay. So we're just gonna pass and see how this plays out. I mean, maybe we'll draw a draw spell? I don't know. That might be asking for a lot. I hope we don't draw a cathartic reunion right now. I actually realized that. Probably should have held on to that. Ah. Let's see who they block with. Double blocking? That seems pretty saucy. I like it. Alright, so we're going to have a few triggers go on here. Alright, and GG's! I'm going to keep... This looks pretty good. We've got a few spells here. We can loot on turn one. Uh, let's see what we draw. Um... I guess we probably don't need the spike field. We'll find out. Okay, let's see how it goes down next turn. I can potentially... I mean, maybe I pitch these two. That draws me three. Three. 
All the same. All right, memory lapse. Okay, don't need any of that. Um... Let's see if I find anything new. Alright, that's not great. Alright, so do we have anything for Finale of Promise here? Mero Regery. Okay. So let's go ahead and blow up the Regery. I'm going to go ahead and play... Kill and Fiend here and see what happens. They might Coco us this upcoming turn. Yeah, it looks like they're going to hold up Coco. Huh. Let's go with Shock to get rid of the body. I don't know, like, okay, so I can potentially Shock to get rid of that threat. Now I'm going to just go with that and Faithless Looting. Now we resolve the second spell. We're not gamers. We did not draw what we were looking for there. Uh, can I go off this turn? If they have a, a trickster, this is a feel bad. So here comes Coco. I mean, it has to be Trickster or Coco because they're they're leaving up four mana. Okay, there's the Trickster. Wow. Um Okay. Creatures have trample, but it's only the ones that have entered the battlefield this turn. Oh, they have the brazen borrower. Good game. <laughs> <laughs> nice. The Brazen Borrower does it. GG's. I entirely uh threw my whole hand away for that. Coco, this is gonna be pretty good. I mean, if that's already getting bodied by a simple block, then I may as well shoot this down now. Yeah, the the Brazen Borrower there was pretty good. It, it would make sense why they went with, uh, with that instead. Oh, they have another Trickster. Well, that's very good. Um, I think I'm just dead, right? Because I can't, I can't beat this. They have three in the air at least. They tap down anything I play this upcoming turn. 
So if I, I'd have to draw a shock here. I don't know if that does what I want it to. So now we pass? Yeah, GG's. So no matter what, I can only block uh, th like a little bit of damage here. So you know what? We'll just let him kill us. Take us out. Kill us. You got us. Very nice. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. There you go. Get in. Good game. GG's. This is a gaming hand I'm keeping. Um, what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I mean, I have enough lands to throw away. So I think I'm going to just keep... Uh, I'm going to play Soul Scar, Right? Try to get on the board now. I probably should be playing more light up the stages. With cathartic and all that, oh. Wow. That is so unlucky. I drew three mountains. In a 19 land deck, I drew three mountains. <laughs> sure. Another mountain? I didn't know I could have more mountains, to be honest. I guess we're going for X being two? Oh my god, that's so good. GG's. Another mountain? No way! Is that possible? I mean, it is possible because we're looking at it. Uh, I've just got a bunch of lands, so that... I, I guess I got the mana pocket out of the way, if that counts for anything. I don't think it does, but whatever. I mean, they just thought seize, so that feels pretty good. Um, what do I want to do here? I probably want to go... Go to damage. And I'll pass. Just in case I draw my fifth land. I was kidding. I didn't think I'd actually do it. Let's see. This is probably settle the wreckage, yeah? But if they get more mountains out of the way for me, that's not the end, so, sure. Uh, sure. Wow, I didn't think that'd get there? We won? I hate- this is so greedy. If they have a single bit of removal, we're so dead. We're so dead. <laughs> oh yeah, this is gonna be so dead. Alright, let's see what they've got. Hopefully no stomp or anything like that. Can I kill them this turn? Okay. So we're gonna put them down to two. Alright, 
No shock lands for them. I just need to find a single burn spell. A shock, a lightning strike, any of the above. Your finest. I wonder if they have a shock land in hand they need to play. <laughs> that would be pretty funny. There's no Uro, so I don't know what you're doing. But this will be great. Okay, seems good. All right. We have Trample. They spend a single shock on us. Like, it doesn't matter. Good game. I will try this hand. How do I want to go about this here? I think I want to save the looting for a turn where I actually cast the arc light. Or, I mean, get to bring back an arc light. Maybe I even draw more than a single arc light here. Wouldn't complain if we did that. They're mulliganing quite aggressively. Please don't be Tibalt's trickery. Uh, let's see, what are they all about here? This is still representing trickery. Oh no. This is gonna go poorly. Oh no. Alright, are we dead? They are the trickery deck. GG's, here it comes. <laughs> just just let me know which way is it put me out of my misery which way is it yeah yeah okay miss 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 and they did not miss they did not miss <laughs> how dead are we how dead are we go off go off creatures with fly <laughs> That's a good beatable. <laughs> good game. Good game. <laughs> Darn it. I'm a gamer, right? Yeah, I'm a gamer. I believe. I believe I'll draw. I'll draw. Come on. Come on, deck. Let me get some phoenixes. Plural, by the way. Plural. Mmm. All right, that's not an additional phoenix. Oh, it's an ooze. Uh, so what, what could I do here? I could potentially pitch that, pitch the other kill and fiend, right? Yeah, check. Then we shock, crash through again. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we're going to go with that. Okay, so they're down to five. They have to stop this turn. They, they absolutely have to stop this turn. The reason I kept the crash through over the shock is that in the event that we need to trample over stuff, which I think we will. We have one card in hand. Very, very straightforward here. Where are my phoenixes? I am a phoenix deck. I promise you I have a phoenix in this deck. I don't think I've actually triggered it once this whole video. Oh no, I did, but it was against Merfolk and we got bodied. Alright. Little Scoozy Vert, you got it.
And that's it. That's lethal. GG. Oh, look at that. Perfect draw. I guess I should go to Vegas. Pretty decent draw there. How do you feel about this now? Would you like to choose how to block here? Well, not enough, buddy. Not enough. Uh, I'll keep. This seems decent. Alright, so it's Jeskai Control. The only way we're going to beat them is through hitting all of our phoenixes. So... Let's see how this goes. Not going to hit a phoenix today, so... It's unlikely that I keep a creature. I'm going to just work my way towards 5 mana. The only creatures I think I'll be able to win with legit is Phoenix. So they have Memory Lapse? Oh, that's something we can't get Memory Lapse at all, or that's a real feel bad. Um, that's a Faithless Looting. I have no other... I'm gonna just pass. Oh no, if they hit a Teferi here, that's pretty good. Actually, I think I'm still worried about Narset the most. Uh, I'll try to fire this off again. Oh boy. Do they have some kind of exile effect? Hopefully not. Or another helix. That's kind of feel bad. Oh, it just... Okay, that, that's not the end for us. Wait, what is this? I mean, I'm just going to play this anyways. It's probably going to get memory lapsed or something. Infuriate. That's not going to do anything. That's not going to do anything. That's not going to do anything. This is going to get countered. So on the brighter side, at least I know for a fact that I'll be able to get... I'm closer with another land, right? Oh, all right. Well, what does that mean for us? To fairy time? Uh, how do I go about this? Okay. Wow, that feels really bad to draw. Uh, what are they playing? I, I don't know. Is this like Gear Hulk? Send me into the moon or something like that?
Um, is this gonna resolve? Probably not, right? Sure. Reasonable. So they're gonna tap down my Phoenix, probably kill off... Okay, hold on. So we're gonna float mana here. May I actually draw two one-mana spells? Oh, thank gosh. What a pro. And we win the game? All right, and I'll take it. Seems good. Send all of that in at them. There's no swords. GG. Well, the deck definitely got a jump on a lot of people. We were able to just surprise pack a ton of damage uh, and showcase the points where in the late game when we can get a, just enough velocity to spin through our deck, we can just keep reoccurring our phoenixes over and over and over. We aren't, you know, packing cards like Brainstorm, but we are a little more explosive out of nowhere thanks to Killin' Fiend and, you know, the Soul Scars and yada yada yada. Uh, but yeah, the deck is fun. I think it's still very, very weak to any kind of, uh, let, let's say, a Narset. I, I realize I don't think we have a single way to legit deal with a Narset other than to extend the hand. So we need to change a little bit of that. And I could see us playing cards like um, uh, Light Up the Stage. Maybe instead of a Cathartic Reunion or, or something like that, because I think we have more than enough ways to discard here. But yeah, fun deck all around and just great for best of one. Because uh, quick games, and if your opponents aren't ready, then you're going to win. Thank you so much for watching another episode of Single Scoop. And as always, I do appreciate it if you'd uh, leave a follow. And of course, a subscribe. You know, all the basic call to action stuff. You know, leave a like, a comment. Come hang out in the comment section. And of course, as always, if you want to be notified of another video coming out, make sure you hit that bell icon. And lastly... Uh, you can also find me on twitch.tv slash the Asian Avenger playing not only magic, but survival horror, MMOs, all the things, every gaming thing in the world. And then it also you can find me on social media at the Asian Avenger, whether that's Twitter or Instagram. Feel free to give me a follow there. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you at the next video. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, help us out by clicking that like button down below. And to keep up on all the latest and greatest, click that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that bell icon to get alerts whenever we have new videos. And if you want to, check out some of our other sweet videos here and here.